Have you ever wondered why some people seem to remain in relationships that are evidently harmful or toxic to them? Often, the answer lies in a psychological concept known as trauma bonding. But how does this differ from true love? Today we dive deep into this intriguing topic. In the bustling city of New York, we find Sarah, a successful lawyer who seems to have it all. However, her personal life tells a different story. She's in a relationship with Mark, a man who emotionally manipulates her, yet she finds it impossible to leave him. This is a classic example of a trauma bond. Trauma bonding occurs when a person develops a strong emotional attachment to someone who intermittently mistreats or abuses them. It's a survival mechanism deeply rooted in our evolutionary past where forming such bonds could mean the difference between life and death. On the other hand, we have the story of Olivia and Jake, a couple from the tranquil suburbs of Oregon. They share a deep connection, rooted in mutual respect, trust and understanding. Even during their disagreements, they communicate openly, always striving for resolution without resorting to manipulation or harm. This, dear listeners, is the essence of true love. True love is marked by a deep emotional connection that is nurturing, supportive, and free from harm or manipulation. Now, let's compare these two scenarios. In Sarah and Mark's relationship, the bond is formed out of a cycle of abuse and reconciliation. Sarah is continuously subjected to emotional turmoil, but the intermittent acts of kindness from Mark create a powerful bond that keeps her tied to him. This is the insidious nature of a trauma bond. It can often be mistaken for love due to the intense emotions involved, but it's fundamentally different from true love. On the flip side, Olivia and Jake's relationship is based on mutual respect and understanding. Their love is not contingent on manipulation or fear, but rather it thrives on healthy communication, empathy and shared experiences. This is a hallmark of true love, a bond that fosters growth, happiness and emotional well-being. To summarize, trauma bonds and true love are vastly different. A trauma bond is an unhealthy attachment formed in a cycle of abuse and reconciliation, often mistaken for love due to the intense emotions involved. It's a survival mechanism deeply entrenched in our psychological makeup. True love, in contrast, is a healthy emotional bond marked by mutual respect, trust, understanding and a shared life experience. It fosters growth, happiness and emotional well-being. So if you find yourself questioning whether your relationship is a trauma bond or true love, remember Sarah and Olivia's stories. The comparison can provide clarity and perhaps guide you towards healthier relationships because everyone deserves to experience true love, free from manipulation and harm. And that's a wrap on trauma bonds versus true love. Remember, understanding these concepts is the first step to fostering healthier relationships. Until next time,